mtoto ako na miaka 14 15 you telling me this person amepewa jukumu ambayo hapa Nairobi amepea mtu jukumu ambayo tumepea hapa watu Nairobi ati protect watu that is child labor first thing mtoto ako under age unampea kazi ya protect community kama nani kila mtu analia FGM girl child FGM sijui huyu hawana sanitary power hawana nini but boy child amumie anafanywa moral hello guys welcome to our youtube channel if you're new here <laughs> subscribe like share comment down below yeah that cabell that cabell <laughs> yeah so uh today we are going to be talking about different cultures and we are going to specifically be focusing on moranism samburu culture moranism i think to start this off uh i am basically not for the culture for moranism mm. i am so against it oh my god and since you claim to be so for it tell us the reason first before we <laughs> if I can give my own side of this one. So. Let me give sasa the context ya moranism. Eh? If you are a guy, listen to me. Eh? Number one, when you are a moran, you are given liberty to do what you can appertain. Unaona ile like I give you power to read and you do whatever you want. Moranism. Mhm. Mm so how old are the morans? From what age? It Because depends. they have the liberty from what age? It, 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 it depends but this, these people are so young like from 14 you giving someone liberty at the fictitious adulthood what is that doesn't really make sense to me do you know like in moranism like when they go they are taught culture they are taught how to live with each other they are taught how to respect the elders it is their norm there yeah. it's it's how they, you know these a form of informal education oh and what happened to the formal education these kids go become morans they stay away from school like seriously this world today without papers who are you so these kids go to the wild because when you are moran you live in the wild for like 10 to 11 years 10 to 11 years no formal education what do you know kuua simba huko kuua birds which is actually infringing on the wild I don't like it. No, as in this is the way of life. Eh eh. Unajua it's like a Chinese. Mtoto amezaliwa ajaanza kufunzwa kungufu. Who tells them about it? Kungufu, kungufu si kutuma mtoto akaishi msituni. Morans are soldiers. No. Wanafunzwa kuwa soldiers. Okay. As so, in <laughs> I, I want to put it like this. Eh? Okay. That's their way of life. Uh-huh. Do you know a rich person? Uh-huh always feels that the poor person is suffering. Mm-hmm. The poor person from his or her perspective mm-hmm. are comfortable with whatever he or she has. Mm-hmm. But they live. Mm-hmm. You as a city girl ukiangalia hawa say unaona hawa say waishi wanaishi kama wanyama. But from their perspective me I'm sure kuna kids who are like they are looking up to like I want to be a moran. These are kids who are raised in that community that wants yeah. to be moran. And from that point you said this that is the taught to be what do you say? They are taught to be soldiers. Not do we need soldiers. kids soldiers? No. Seriously, do no. we need kids soldiers? It's not. And these kids we're teaching them how to use these weapons. They come back. They claim they are protecting the society, which is not happening. Mm. These kids are, the, are still the same people unatembea unaenda pande ya mara mara lal and <laughs> They're the same people who will shoot down your tires, they'll do all this thing. They just it's basically just promoting vandalism and not very really. crazy ideas which not I am not really. in for. This is culture. Mm-hmm. You know you are arguing for a po- from a point of view you are imperialist. No, I am looking oh, at all the so disadvantages. What are you advocating for? Education. Yes, education. Rights, equality. There's so many things that are so different. For instance, let's start with that moralism thing, yeah? Uh-huh. When you become a moral, yeah. you can imagine this person is 14 years. They are not allowed to sit in the same space with a woman. First thing discrimination, yeah? So, you can imagine someone tells you, 
uh, a very small kid tells you I can't sit in the same space as a woman. This kid can't go back to their own home, which is their right in the constitution. They need to have a home. They can't go back home. They can't eat food that's cooked in their homestead. What after Chakula Uko Wakule? You know, what kind of life first is of this? all, this is not the first Moran. Yeah, it's not. But they we have, need to stop it. No, they have been surviving. Mm -hmm. See, they they even reached 100 years. I'm a 70. Did you see that? They, they, they even maybe. Are you one that's 100? It's only one beer. Ukiwa una training. It's a training. Like, uh, it's an a form, uh, any informal education. Like, una pele kwa pale kwa bush. And you are given responsibilities. Kama ni kukula, utakula na boys wako mm -hmm. kwa msitu. Mm -hmm. Ama mali mtakuwa. Bora tu, usikuje kule nyumbani. Sawa. Unakula Kwa hiyo msitu, ni nini hiyo wanakula? Okay, unajua... Kwa hiyo msitu, ni nini wanakula? You know, like, what, really, really according to their culture, yes. they live out there. Mm -hmm. Because, like, Morani Zimon, they are told, like, you should not come. Oh, unenda unakunyeshwa hiyo... Yo ni ni like uki ukienda ukatwe sindi o inazana na circumcision first of all after circumcision you go and take kuna ngombe unapewa then you una chi una chinja then you bring a piece of the meat kuma mayako yes apparently yo sasa ina manisha sasa mama yo ni mekulipa chakula tosha ni nisha yes ni mekulipa yivyo sasa Jukua ngombe yako. Wow, how nice. You That's see. A, with, with, a, with a very tiny piece you, of meat, you, you, you appreciate your mom. No, it is the culture. So, I love you now. Well, you know the ask. problem yeah. with now, the men we have currently, our pendi struggle. I want to brother. I want to like in a brotherhood. Morani is in a good jam. We are in a brother. You need to be loyal, Jesus. Oh, yeah, no, brother. On a drum, Moran is in a jukuhasa. I know. Like any Moran is in the queen advocate for guys going out there to do what? Bonding with your brothers in a letter, your agalcha of no, your pamojanes, your togetherness in doing a common agenda which is protecting the community. By the way, the girls in that community love the Morans. They love the Morans. Is that why the um, th there's a story I saw before in Kajiado. So you say the girls love the Morans. Is this the reason why the Morans weren't breaking into a school claiming they want the girls for marriage? Ah, Sana Katoroka Kweda kwa this um, female, what's the, what are these places called? Um, the Iran went to, um, we can say, female protection centers. <laughs> yeah. Is that the reason why the Iran went there? Because these we girls know they oh. have rights. In the Child Act 141, Part 2, there is no discrimination. Mm. There's a bit about education. There's a bit about healthcare. Healthcare, I'm not talking about story, honestly. Ah, there's things you. You the so there's things you can't treat in the bushes. There's things you can't treat in the bushes. One thing we don't understand about this whole thing. You are quoting the here rights and the rights. Yeah. Do you know the constitution that we are using in the Konga ya Mzungu? Okay, it was complicated in 1961 in Lancaster House, then on it will be 2010, which year 2010 and it will be America. Why are we not original? Why are we not original? The guys that tell you to leave your culture, where is Nabongo Mumia, the king of the Wanga? He died. Mona Atwoni is succession. Why do we need to see that? In England, there is a queen. Yes. In Spain, there is a king. Yes. In these countries, Bado Ame have called their culture, I mean, they have the, the monarchy. Uh -huh. But here you have been told to go with... Monarchy with... ambao Mr. Kiwa Juzi wanafaa kuhulipa no, pesa to monarchy. the UK government. It's monarchy. Come on, you cannot yes, give me that. It is monarchy. No. And here you have been told, I will not push buy. with democracy. I will not buy. So, with that, don't quote for me the constitution. Okay, quote I for will me quote the constitution. It every single but thing. allow me to say, Mwachamila ni mtumwa. Mwachamila ni mtumwa. Mwachamila ni mtumwa. It's good what you are promoting. We are going to tell the Morans, no, Manze, this is wrong that you are doing. But these people shall be excommunicated. And you know, you, you know, just brought up something. Whatever you are going to say, whatever you are going, there will be an attack. Yeah. Maybe from the Sabahwaj, yeah. maybe from the Pokot community. 
and if these morals will not be there to protect this community because it's their way of life it a failure on their part because they are the people to uphold that you know that's a culture that's their norm okay. it's a responsibility so, guys here in these communities like in Nairobi for instance and these major cities don't know the responsibilities I'm for moralism because it teaches the young kids the young men wow you just said young kids. responsibility thank you. thank you so these people are still kids according to our constitution you are an adult when you get to 18 and so in line with that you said this kids as you, as you call them as you call them are meant to protect their community so protecting the community there are raids happening nearly every single day so these raids they claim they are protecting the community do you know how old these kids are when they begin learning how to handle a spear how to handle an arrow because in one of the videos that we saw about samburu there was a kid who had quite a number of birds and at ease of birds and you how brave that kid is so you go shooting birds up from the trees killing them putting them in, in your head is that not endangering our 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 indigenous species again the raids these are things that are not very good. You cannot tell me you're protecting your community because you're a moral. So you go stealing from other people, then Sasa Vita in Akua, oh, there was a raid. We're just trying. That does not really make sense. You know, because it's usually, it's usually you know, some sort of challenging of each all, other so you can first, see who uh, uh, is stronger than you. I, I like to respond to that kindly. First of all, Morans, Moranism, it's a process. Yes, it is. When these guys are there in the forest, they are taught how to use these indigenous trees to make medicine. Who teaches them? The elders. During the elders, that ceremony. The elders are not Morans, they stay in their villages. But they are already taught like the process of Moranism, how like, there is a ceremony. Mm -hmm. They are taught all this, how to make medicine out of indigenous trees. Mm -hmm. That's a fact. You know. And uh, what did you talk about here, yeah, Mushu? Uh, the raids? The raids. First of all, you should understand, these people don't live in Nairobi. Yeah. They don't live in these cities. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Somewhere at the end of Zijuwabi. Your place, they are their own security. Yes. Their way of life ni pastoralism. And the neighboring communities are maybe in Apokot, Kuna the Turukanas, and these people, they are also pastoralists. Mm -hmm. And these people believe Mwambe si amtu, Mwambe ni mwenye meiba, mwenye meichukua, mwenye konayo ni mwambe yaki. That's their way of life. Yeah. So if people want to go and take these mwambes, leave them. So it their, way of, their life. way of life. Good. Your culture bit about their way of life is Guibiana. So stealing from people is not wrong. And then I'll just take you back to the point about um, safeguarding the community. That still goes. That, I, I tell you, that really breaks my heart because it goes down to so many things. Mtoto hapa na miaka 14, 15. You're telling me this person amepewa jukumu ambayo hapa na Nairobi, amepewa mtu jukumu ambayo tumepewa hapa watu na Nairobi to protect us. That is child labor first thing. Mtoto ako under age, unampea kazi ya protect community kama nani? They are elder morans, they will do that. Huh? Because I don't get the point then. Even it is still under child labor, you like, cannot convince me true, not today, not it tomorrow. It can be child labor, it is. but no, it cannot when be. we go it to war, how do you put your, your weaklings belly? When you go to war, let's just see it as it is, yeah? Back in the day, when people went to war, it was the men. Children, children and women stay back at home. These people are children. They are 14, they are 15. They are not 18 yet. No, it depends. Uh-huh. On what? It depends on, on what? The, the size of the body? Not really. The height? Not really. <laughs> How much they eat? But I want to say this. Eh? These are young boys. Mm -hmm. Young Some boys. Some of them are senior morans. Mm -hmm. These ones are just shown like the way, as in there might be raids and we shall protect our communities mm. and the old women are not against it they want to be protected 
But can you recall there's a time there was a Kamati or mm -hmm. that they they were saying they want to do away with the morality. Yeah. Because yeah. Oh, this must say yeah, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Because these men were, were sat down and they were told A, B, C, D, these are the advantages and these are the disadvantages. And upon sitting down and weighing what is what, they saw there is no point in having this. So they sat down two people, by the way. This whole thing sending our kids out eleven years doesn't really make sense. Then after you eleven years and the other boys are cut, well, you are not eleven years. Now can be a sit a watcher. It's sita not watch. actually. How do you how do I sit down and send my form two out to do my form one? I end up with Chipam C2. Huh? I cannot. I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. Because you are a city parent. Yes. yes. You are a city and it, person. And it is because education opens up your brains, opens up your mind. First of all, you cannot tell speaking me. Speaking of education, yes. In this country, mm -hmm. the education you are telling free. me, first of all, <laughs> is free for yes. other people. It is free. In, in this community, so in Basoloi, Samburu County, mm -hmm. in Basoloi, Samburu County, yes. there is no school and your Zen education is free. It is free. It is free. There are places you in cannot, this country you that cannot, we don't have, we can't have access to education. You cannot sit me down and First tell of all, me, let me, in let a whole Samburu, there isn't a single school. Okay, there because are schools, but Zile the thing is they go far away. They are not going to be able to report the KCP, but they are not going to be able to report the KCP. They are not Samburu? Wapi? Mention these places, my guy. Mention these places. This is where, you are going to be able to report the KCP, and you are but they try to educate these people, okay. enlighten okay. them. Okay, let me say this. This helps remove this um, let me say this. ignorance from these people. They get to you know what's say, right and what's wrong. Uh, thank you. What's beneficial to them and what's not beneficial. Let me uh, let me answer your question. Education silazima ikwe ya class. You are very sad. Education from our ancestors, ilikuwa inapitishwa from a generation to the other. Informal education, mm -hmm. kama wezi pata formal education. Yes. First of all, the education system in this country. Yes. How many unemployment cases do we have in this very, very country? Very many, sir. Thank you. And the system is, muna nusuma class, class one mbaka class eight. Mm -hmm. All that in a kwanga too for one reason. Mm -hmm. Do wende shule ya upili poa. Mm -hmm. Do wende alliance. Mm -hmm. Then Alafu. you get to secondary school. Mm. Also me upate knowledge. Unasoma wende university. Ah. Then you go to university. Uh -huh. Also me in the upate knowledge of society community. Uh -huh. Unasoma upate kazi. Umetoka ba nayo yako. Tusha kujua sasa. Unamaliza. <laughs> this is a, it's very sad. It's very sad. It is, it is. It's but you know, sad. It's, it's very funny because but not how everyone do you goes advocate to school for the same, for the same, same reasons same you're things. mentioning. It's true, like that's the I didn't go to school. I, I didn't go to school for the same reasons. But, I, I was enjoying the whole but, process. But, but, but the government enjoys like at you na some and you but a job. Where are the jobs? Where you, are you the do jobs? Not, you do not need to be employed. You can be your own boss. From what you have learned, and you know, times have really, really changed. Whereas in MBA, in informal education, it'll help you. Come and tell us, what do they need, basically? Chakula? You, you have even seen these guys have a problem with water. So they should learn how to make water. You what, what after you knew that you uh, your hydrogen and oxygen makes water, what has it changed? Now you know it too. Okay, you know it too. <laughs> so I want to say this, eh? Mm -hmm. Moranism. Okay, you can advantages mm -hmm. and disadvantages. Thank you for saying I, that. I agree, I agree, Mamba children's rights, yes. you know, like yes. the right to go to school, mm -hmm. the right to to have parental care. Mm -hmm. But for us guys, wanaume squeeze to kama wanaume. You see a city kid and mvulana me. Ana baby you are, baby you are. Me, mine, I talk about where we are, my bazenga, my bazoo. 
Suppose zama ati akuna chi akuna bala street and labor in the city. Ena kwa ghetto manzi. Watu yola bebe shamba mitungi yola pele kama vitu. Wala na uza kwa nini? Eh? Wengine urona ngata au wameja. Eh no, that's not the issue. If I look at it from ghetto, now they are going to read different things because in circumstance ulijipata. Was a zoko kwa this life. Thank you. So you just have to make you have to make ends meet. How what was moralism? They don't have to make ends meet by Thank going to you. live in the forest. Walijipata they wakuko. can no. Ni msisi jasema wale morans wale wale jipata over here and they can change and stop doing it. But what happens when someone says they don't want to become a moran? Una pigwa mbako una kubali kuwa moran. I have seen videos online that what's that? If you don't sign into your YouTube, it tells you um, the content is inappropriate. You need to sign in so you can see, and it needs to get your legal age. So mm-hmm. you can imagine, come up such a content about someone, um, um, what's this? Someone deciding not to take up the challenge of being born. Why are you no, being forced? Uh, why are you being forced into this right? It, it is it, a it, culture. I, I feel like why it's are, a very wrong to to right school? of passage to get rid of your ignorance. Why, why uh, are you against us doing our moralism thing and mm. you're forcing us to do your education? First, we start with the constitution. Why do you think? We start with the wait, constitution. The constitution article was 60, not ours. Age of the person. It was Article 26. No. 260. And first, it's about the age. My biggest problem is these are kids. There are so many rights they're being deprived of. Which rights? Oh my God, in heaven. Parental care. Who parents them? Who is your parent? Who is your parent? Basic thing. Who is your parent? So you lack parental care. You can't come back to your mother's house and sleep in there. Where do you want to go to your mother's house? Hey, my guy, you're 14. You're a baby. What baby? <laughs> These people grow fast. Okay, growing fast. I'm 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 a poor kubo. Muli ni kubo asasa. Me ni jepo muli kubo asasa. I am really not buying into it. And the issue about reads, yeah. infringement of the on the world, and uh, um, what's this? Apparently, <laughs> community protection. And basically, right now, if you look at what um, we are trying to do, and the government is trying to do, is equality, yeah. male and female. Mm. But that is not happening in um, morality in the um, communities that practice morality because there is discrimination against the woman, discrimination see? against the girl child. See, a boy and a girl are not seen as, as, see? as the same thing. These are children, you but see? they are seen as different genders. Oh my which god! Really, please a very. I don't know. I think I'd say a very oh, sad I hope you've heard what she's just said. I hope she has been here from moralism. Now let's hear about what feminist, feministic ideology. Guy, guy, uh, guy. Let me I've ask given you. you more than ten let, points. Let, let, You're not let, bringing let, let, feminism let, 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 to tell me, me that I'm ha. Guy, I've given you very many points. Do you points know about in this country, boy chala na kwanga mi umizwa. Sana. What if no one has ever imam? Mamia nini ingine kama si fair? Kuna tu ma fair. Nina kuruwa. Ume toka uka morani zinu mbuwa ma simba. Uka uza meno ya simba. Hai. Amke uka uza. Ili kutusulia. Kai. Una uza za zote na fina. Anyways. Uyu mutu. Lakini what I want to say. My point is. Boi chenda mamizwa. Eh? Yeah. The whole these children rights organizations are feminist FGM kila mtu analia FGM girl child FGM sijui oh ya wana solidarity ba oh ya wana nini but boy child am mimi anafanywa moral imagine aishi kwa story ya moral lakini which organizations oh, no. you said boy child am mimi am mimi which organizations do you know they stand up for the rights of a boy child you are speaking of moralism, moralism, mm-hmm. moralism. Mm-hmm. There are no organization. Very rare. Because everybody will focus on the girl child. Mm-hmm. So what we want with our morans, we are standing out for ourselves. Mm-hmm. Because they don't care about us, we are going to protect ourselves. Mm-hmm. We are going to take care of ourselves. My brother, we are going to take care of ourselves. 
Because nobody cares about even the organizations kikuja samburu ni girls. Yes. Actually, girls wa meitua huko. Mm-hmm. Una ungekua boy, ungezikia aje. Wasitana wenu ndi wa meitua. Na wewe, moran huku, hape ngini hata yuwa fibo, hauna yomu ilia kuenda kupigana. Uja hituwa. Uyo moran hata hata ajua kwa msiru hata ajua kama girls to ni kujua. In fact, utazikia uko na umama. Munafua kuena na ome girls huko. Kwa campaign za so, FGA. Anyway, so, as we wrap it up, give us your final yeah. My win family. me over. Win me over to that Moran bit. Okay. Moranism. As you said. Okay, I was nili kuona kusikiza tu. Mm. But kuna tu kweli uko na watu. Mingi. Hey. Hizo za rights mm. ni kweli. Children's mm. rights very important. Constitution you know I am a lawyer too. Unaona hizi mavitabu. Mimi nimesoma kusoma. <laughs> yes. But unajua mimi nimeenda na that point. Mm-hmm. As in in Kenya for instance and Africa we don't have an identity. We don't have an identity. What do you mean by we don't Guys have an identity? Guys all over the world, you know, when you want to know a Nigerian, from the language, you know, to Ogana, you know, that's a Nigerian. When you see a Ghanaian, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you these robes, you know, you know, you know, many colors. When you want to see a South African, you know, to, like, there's a way South Africans look. In Kenya, people will know about Maasai. And if these cultures we are going to lose, where are the Watanese coming from? We need to retain these cultures. What we put them a story, they come and see like, wow, this is a very brilliant way of living. Not really brilliant, but at least we need these people where they like Because well, we are slowly well, listen, listen, it's my final, my final remark, eh? Wataruga Ruka. But we need to continue with our culture. Because as we are continuing with the globalization and everything, we are slowly turning Europeans. We are going west. Manze we are dressing like them. Oh, na mimi. Manze ni mefa nini? Ni ini, ni designer uga. Uga vangozi, basi. Baba, uga vangozi. Not ngozi. Basi uga vangozi. Tuna tengeneza out of, ni ni, what is it called? Out of court. Kwa tuada. Eh? But we are slowly losing our culture. And we need these people when you want to uphold mm-hmm. at least to have an identity because I'm assuming in like 50 years, I could have a difference here. Mzungu na Sisi. You will still be black. We will talk about black anyway, Americans. Anyway, anyway. So, I would not want to win you over because Mzungu. I know. For the culture, Jesus. I know. For the culture. I know. For the culture. Anyway, so, on. as I finish it off, yeah? All I would say is, let us know what is happening out here. Constitution, to sum of this thing, let us know all our rights. Let us know what is wrong, what is right. Let us not remain in ignorance, claiming that it is beneficial to us. Unless it is really 100% beneficial to you. And to everyone around you, then pass it. If it harms even a single person around you, it's a no. Yeah, that's for me. Anyways, so guys, just as we started, we are still on different <laughs> wavelengths. But I think I bought him in a bit. I think I bought him in a bit. Anyway, so guys, <laughs> like, um, subscribe, subscribe and do not forget to comment. comment. We want to know what you guys think. Yeah? We want to know what you guys think uh-huh. because it is very important. I need to know how many people are out here supporting this. And Mimi, Wakanda forever. Kanda unga chapati. Wagun! Papkan. Bye guys!